What's up guys? Good morning. Another day, another dollar. Holla. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, it is actually Tuesday morning. Started at Captain's Log Tuesday morning. Um, I'm going to be trying to make a bunch more vlogs for you guys. I know you guys want to see more content and honestly, I just get so busy during the day that I forget to grab the camera. Fun little story this morning. I was already at the gas station and just filling up the tank while I went inside to get a, a Red Bull. It's a, gonna be a busy, tight day. And while I was up there, the lady that was in front of me, she was paying cash and she was a little short. So she ran out to her car and the gas station guy up there, who I'm really cool buds with, uh, I go, no, let me just get this Red Bull, add it to her order and I'll just pay for it. And he goes, no, no, no. I go, yeah, 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 yeah. He goes, no, no. I go, dude, just do it, hurry up. You're gonna embarrass me if she comes back in. And uh, I don't want to. I don't want. I want to be anonymous, right? And so anyway, uh, he brings up the Red Bull, and I didn't know the lady had like twenty-seven dollars worth of stuff. <laughs> I thought she had like a Snickers bar and a Red Bull. It's all right in front of me, but apparently, man, that stuff adds up pretty quick. I mean, whatever. I was just laughing. I was like, damn, twenty-seven bucks. But all right. So hey, today uh, it's one of those days where Rob and I on Tuesday we're normally done by about 1.30, 2 o'clock. Uh, my goal today is to skip lunch. Sometimes we skip lunch and we just, you know, haul butt and get them all done. Uh, because I've got to vote today. So if you guys uh, haven't voted yet in your primaries for your state, whenever it comes up for you, make sure you do that. I'm not gonna tell you what side to vote for. You guys are grown adults, you can make your own decisions, but uh, just make sure that you vote for the side that you uh, believe in with their party platform not what the candidates say. All right, let's just leave it at that. Uh, number two, Liz and I are meeting with the architect today. So we're literally meeting with the architect and the builder today for the house uh, and for the land. <sighs> Feels good, bro. Feels good. I'm going to be broke after this meeting, but that's a whole other story for a whole other time. <laughs> Anybody ever build a custom home before? If so, leave me some comments. You guys know how it is. So, all right, well, that's my uh, day today. Let's take you guys through it. I'm really excited about today. It's uh, kind of doomy gloomy. It's like 64 degrees out. You guys can see it's cloudy. Uh, not much happening today. I'm actually wearing a long sleeve shirt. I've got my high vis in the back seat just in case that it gets a little warm and we want to take care of it with uh, being a little bit cooler today. So, all right, let's jump inside. Can't wait to take you guys with us and uh, let's go mow some grass and make the day happen and hopefully knock this day out by about one o'clock and uh, get all those other obligations done.
guys, well, we are back here dropping the trailer off. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the mowing footage and what we were able to show with uh, the GoPros. By the way, uh, trying to change up the angle a little bit for you guys. I know a lot of you guys have been saying that helps kind of keep the attention and uh, you like just seeing the different vantage points while we work. I agree, I know what you guys are saying. Uh, I love watching all you guys' videos too when we uh, are out mowing grass and doing the whole deal, right? Uh, it's just after one o'clock, so uh, we went as fast as we could, did a great job, the lawns were thick. So, now, get to run home, hopefully grab a bite to eat on the way, and then we're gonna go vote, and then we gotta be by the architect by three o'clock. So, a lot to do, a lot to continue on. Um, oh, hey, one thing I gotta show you guys, this just came in the other day. I uh, had a little snafu while I was plowing snow, and uh, I haven't told anybody this because I didn't want to be overly embarrassed. Just making sure I'm in park. I uh, had to get a new cap for the running board. So I was going around a fountain and uh, it scraped off my uh, little bumper plate here, whatever you call this. And uh, it was like 25, 30 bucks, a little bit of hardware. I'll show you guys really quick. Don't judge me, all right? But make a little mistakes while you plow snow, right? So if you guys have seen this in any of the vlogs, it completely scraped right off. And uh, there's a little bracket here I gotta uh, change out. We'll put this back on, but hey, you know, whatever. It is what it is, don't judge me. Real life, banging stuff a little bit with thunder. Thankfully, that was all the damage though, right? Um, and I did find the other cap, the old cap, but uh, the brackets are broke. They like clip in and there's that screw, so I wasn't able to uh, salvage the old one. But all right, well, guys, uh, I'm gonna keep moving here. Let me take you guys with us. Maybe we'll do a quick little like sneak peek from the, the architect and going into that. Uh, that's it for today's vlog, if you will. Uh, you know what? It's been fun doing these, and I'm trying to do more content for you guys as uh, you know we get recharged. When the weather breaks, it's a lot easier to shoot videos. I'll tell you guys that. Uh, when it's 94 degrees out, look, I'm, I'm human too. But uh, one last thing is if you guys saw on the last video, uh, or maybe even this video, Paul Jameson just dropped uh, an episode, episode 200 on the Green Industry Podcast, talking about a little bit of an update with Liz and I's story. And we really go into it talking about the land we purchased, uh, the house we wanna build, the pole barn we wanna build. So if you guys haven't yet checked out Paul's uh, 200th episode, big shout out to him to keep that thing going and uh, just an amazing resource for the industry. I'll try to leave a link in the description uh, and then go over there or shoot Paul a DM and say, hey, Brian sent ya. Uh, but it was just, again, really cool just hosting him this last weekend up at the house. So, all right guys, well, that's it. Um, I'll get a little B-roll here, a little uh, footage as we close this out. But thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up. Help me appease the algorithm gods. And we'll catch up with you guys on the next one.